Welcome to the DLR webcast. Spaceliner is the vision of an intercontinental passenger transport powered by rocket propulsion. So intercontinental means, for example, flying from Australia to Europe in 90 minutes. Spaceliner is best suited for intercontinental distances, not for short or medium uh, hold distances. Um, for example, this is the, our reference mission from Australia to Europe, but it could be also from uh, Europe to uh, west coast of America, from Europe to East Asia, or from East Asia to America, trans-Pacific flight. So the very long distance flights, which take us today between 20 and 30 hours in conventional aircraft. We started the Spaceliner project uh, about seven years ago. Well, the uh, Spaceliner is accelerated by rocket propulsion. Uh, rocket propulsion is extremely powerful and we are able to accelerate the Spaceliner within less than 10 minutes to uh, 25 times the speed of sound. The Spaceliner is using rocket propulsion with uh, liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen as uh, propellants. Liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen burns to water, so the exhaust of the space liner is only water. We started the space liner project uh, about seven years ago. There are several steps. We are still in a very early development stage. We are uh, working with the concurrent engineering facility at DLR in joint workshops of engineers, interdisciplinary workshop of engineers, looking into all kinds of relevant technologies. Later, we will go to the uh, cryogenic lab here in Bremen, testing new super lightweight tanks uh, with, under cryogenic conditions, under sloshing behavior on, on a shaker. We also will later uh, qualify uh, subcomponents like electronics on shaker uh, test stands. The fact that the space liner flies from Australia to Europe in 90 minutes, of course, interests me a lot and was one of the attracting factors to this topic because it is so close to home, quite literally for me. Um, at the moment, a flight from Australia to Germany is somewhere around 30 hours altogether, um, which is obviously a very, very long way to fly and quite exhausting. So the opportunity to fly in 90 minutes the same journey is very appealing. So my name is Olga Trevelo and I come from Australia. I'm doing my PhD work here in um, System and Lizeram Transport um, Department and the focus of my work includes cost engineering in terms of the, co the space liner concept. So in this respect um, we're looking at development costs, production costs and operation costs. So it's something that combines I guess the technological side as well as the economical and financial aspects of this project. The technology used for the space liner could be used in the future also as a, a transportation system to orbit. One of the goals is to develop a new passenger transport for the future. The other goal is to find a new market for uh, rocket technology. 
and significantly reduce the cost of uh, transportation to orbit. We're hoping that it'll be realised realistically within 30 to 40 years. It seems like a long time, but the time is required for obviously to test and satisfactorily establish its safety, given that there's passengers involved. Thank you. This was a DLR webcast.